गुड मॉर्निंग फ्रेंड्स टुडे इज सेकेंड जुलाई टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी थ्री थर्टीन संडे इन ऑर्डनरी टाइम द कॉमन थीम ऑफ टूडेज रीडिंग्स इज द विटनेसिंग मिशन गिवन टू क्रिश्चियंस टू लव गॉड एंड आर ब्रदर्स एंड सिस्टर्स टू हॉस्पिटैलिटी जेनरसिटी एंड द प्रैक्टिस ऑफ कॉर्पोरल एंड स्परिचुअल वर्कस ऑफ मर्सी इन आर फर्स्ट रीडिंग टूडे वी रीड the welcoming given to prophet elisha by an elderly childless couple the wife recognized the holiness of elisha she showed him reverence and hospitality by inviting him to dine with her and her husband in an arranging an upper room of their house so that elisha might stay with them when he visited the area In response Elisha promised her this time next year you will be fondling a baby son the promise was fulfilled by God today's responsible psalm reminds us that we are the children of God who tells us my mercy is established forever today's second reading taken from Paul's letter to the Romans explains why those who care for the followers of Jesus are caring for Jesus himself and those who show hospitality to any one of them are eligible for a reward today's gospel concludes Jesus' great mission discourse in which Jesus instructs the 12 apostles on the cost of the reward of the commitment required of a disciple First half of these sayings of Jesus details the behavior expected of his disciples and the second half of the behavior expected of others towards the disciples Jesus assures his disciples that whoever shows them hospitality will be blessed Today's Sunday liturgy calls us to do two things one we need to be hospitable The virtue of hospitality is the virtue of recognizing the presence of God in others and nourishing this presence there are many ways of offering hospitality a kind word a smile etc in a cold and in a hospitable world a caring person becomes an oasis of encouragement and companionship second we should be fully alive as christians through the generous giving of ourselves then sending of checks for charitable causes the way we think about people for from that spring will flow the ways we speak to them and about them forgive their failings encourage them show them respect console them and offer them help such generosity reflects warmth radiating from the very love of god a blessed sunday to you all god bless us all amen